So this is what happened here tonight in the Millennium Stadium here in Cardiff. A fantastic crowd, and as always, the track was prepared fantastically well. We had great racing right from the opening heat, and Chris Holder really did get us off to a flying start with that fantastic win in heat number one. And we saw lots and lots of passing. We saw Greg Hancock in good form at times. Disappointing night for Kenneth Vieira, you have to say, who's dropped back to fourth in the World Championship standings now. Uh, despite the impressive rides on occasions from Nichols and Harris, it wasn't a night for the Brits. Davey Watt on occasions looked very impressive, but was excluded after that clash with Nicky Pedersen late on in the meeting. And you just wondered at times whether Jason Crump could make it three out of three. But in the end, he couldn't quite find a way past Chris Holder in the final. We really did see some fantastic racing here tonight, Steve. The British Grand Prix is the winner. It's been great again, and I've got to say that the track deal did hold up a lot better than I thought it would. The track's been great tonight and, and you know, created great, good racing. Nicky Pedersen more than played his part, as he always does. Renewing hostilities with Hans Anderson, which takes us back a couple of seasons. And there we see uh, Jason Cump come crashing down, and there we see from the, the handlebar shot of Chris Holder just what that altercation with uh, Jason Cump was all about. Wheel to wheel racing, very, very tight at times. There we see Davey Watts' challenge come to an end. And there we see Henderson and Anderson not particularly enjoying each other's company later on. But what a night it's been here tonight. A new star has been born in the Millennium Stadium. His name is Chris Holder. His family are here from Sydney, Australia. He had to beat the flying machines that were Jason Crump and Yarrick Hampel in the final. It's the first time he'd ever reached the Grand Prix final, the first time he'd raced at Cardiff. And he managed to leave the stadium with the spoils. Chris Holder's night. He's the champion. He's the British Grand Prix winner.